What is up, motherfuckers? It's Cuddle of Death here, back with another episode of Xenoblade Chronicles. Yay! In the last episode, we visited the weapon development lab, saw a bunch of cutscenes, picked up a lot of quests, and now we're playing as Fiora, which is this girl. So let's get started. Alright, so we need to deliver something special to Shulk before it gets cold, which would be food. And this is telling us that the main story quest will appear on the map. You'll be able to differentiate them from other random quests, which we picked up in the town. Hey, Fiora. Dixon. Looks like you're in a hurry. Where are you off to? I just thought I'd take Shulk some food. I'm on my way to the lab. Shulk's not there right now. Really? I just sent him out to get some fresh air. You know where he'll have gone. Outlet Park. That's the one. Okay. Thanks, Dixon. Okay, so now we have to go to Outlet Park, which is perfectly fine with me. And this is still talking about the quest. It's showing you where to proceed to the quest. I'm going to change some settings really fast before I get really freaking annoyed with camera and map. Alright, so this is going to take just a second. Point of view, that's fine. Rotation. Rotate. Alright. So we're applying these changes. Okay. So, sorry if that took... if that bothers you guys. But we're going to head around this way first because I do believe that there might be some more quests to pick up. Which would be absolutely amazing because, of course, we like getting quests. Um, I think some of the quests can only be done during certain times of the day, if I remember correctly, so it's daytime right now, and some can only be done during the night. Um, this is going to take a minute to take this route. I'm going to get rid of the menu because it's annoying. There we go. But also, it's good to go ahead and discover the different part of the town because we could also discover more landmarks and locations and grab some experience on the way to this particular story quest. Whew. I really like the scenery in this game, like honestly, the view distance is quite, quite nice. So we're in the residential district. Keep your distance, please. Fuck you. So right off the bat, we already have a quest here. Okay. I used to see this bug around all the time, but it's gone now. I would like to see it again. Could you catch it for me? So this is a lady that wants a giant hornet. Hornet? Hornet. Really great. Thank you so much. You never know unless you ask. Well, you ask the right person, because we like quests. Uh, is this quest down here? No, it's up there. Okay. Sorry. Bad with directions. So now, if we go over here, there's this lady who gives another quest. I think. Yeah. What? Well. There we go. I've been getting complaints from customers. Sorry to ask, but could you get me in some kind could you get me some kind of glowing rocks? Why would customers want glowing rocks? So she wants rainbow zirconias. Two of them. Thank you. That should stop me from getting any more complaints. Okay. That's really weird. Um There is a quest item around the back here, I do believe it's on one of these. Give me a second, I'll find it. Some of these are actually really confusing, so bear with me. Where the hell is this? Oh, oh, it's back here. We'll pick up this quest first. Where's my shiny treasure? I get sad if I don't look at it every day. Aw, I'd be really happy if you find it for me. We can find it for you. He wants a blue grass bead. Thank you. I never leave residential district, so it around here somewhere. Please, you have to find my treasure. We will. Don't worry, little cute guy. And here's one of the little search items that we needed in the previous episode the lady lost her key and we found it yay and she can finally get back into her house and in her bed why does it say in the kitchen that's what I want to know okay so we are gonna try to find this little knit thing here we go for this part of the other quest that we have but I don't think that we can get to it Perhaps? Is there... Ugh. I actually honestly don't know how to get to this other part. Over here for this quest. 
The camera angles are terrible right now. Um, can't get in there. Can't. I don't think we can get in there. Yes. Um, okay. So I'm not gonna dwell on stuff for too long because it's just gonna annoy me. And don't worry, I will get these done because this could be a night quest or it could just be me completely spacing out here and not seeing it. But I think that maybe this quest is done at... Ooh, never mind. That's kind of tricky. Okay. So, we just found this thing that helps her sleep at night. That's awesome. Okay, so that's cool. That's the little, little guy that we helped earlier. Holy crap, bad camera angle. Uh, is there a way back out here? Okay. Makes sense. That's, that's really tricky. Okay, so now we're heading over to our main story quest, which is awesome. It's nice that we also got some- we picked up some quests and finished some quests in the meantime. Which is also good because we get gold, and I forgot if some of them give experience or not, I wasn't really reading, I just know that we got gold. And gold is still going to be helpful to get certain items from shopkeepers. And also for collecting items on the way. This episode should not be as long as the other ones have been because... I don't know. Uh, there's not so many cinematics ahead of us, I don't believe, except for this one. Okay. So we're now- we're now out- ha! Ah, we're at Outlook Park. There we go. As soon as the cinematic loads. <laughs> sword that's effective against the Mechon armor. They say that before time began, it was wielded by the Bionis. The same Bionis that we all live on. It must have a secret. That's how Dunban was able to destroy so many Mechon. And why he lost the use of his right arm. If I can just unlock the secret of its power. Shulk! It's your girlfriend. Mm. This is great. It tastes so good. Really? So she got That's him a amazing. sandwich. An amazing oh, sandwich. Shulk, you say that every day. Not quite. Mm. But it doesn't have delicious. a bite taken out of it. What it's the hell? Great. It's amazing. Really? What the yeah. fuck? Look at that. Goodness. I used some special like... herbs and spices today. Yeah, the so special you herbs you use is horny goat them. weed. I'd know for sure you have no sense of taste. What? Oh, I want to learn how to nothing. make a sandwich like this. Like, it's not disappearing. That's crazy. She makes really good sandwiches. That's definitely wife material. That's the only question you need to ask a girl if you want to interview her for being your wife. Can you make a good sandwich? So good. Yeah. <laughs> I've forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> It's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this, always. Foreshadowing. Huh? Major foreshadowing. Uh-oh, see? Already something's gonna happen. The debris siren. It's ongoing. It's the debris siren. That's strange. There hasn't strange. been much falling lately. There's a peep piece of paper. Watch out. A peep, really? <sighs> English, why are you feeling me so bad? Nice fireworks, that's really romantic. There might be more on the way. The anti-air batteries can't protect us out here. Let's get back to the lab. Okay. Okay, so we're avoiding the flying pieces of paper, aka debris that's falling on us, and that's going to end our episode. Sorry, well, actually I'm not sorry about the short episode, it's probably a bit easier to watch. So we're going to continue on in the next episode, and whatever the future holds for us is whatever the future holds for us. Find out in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, I love you so much. Um, you can check out the previous episodes, they, well one of them will be posted as a video response to this, and I also have a playlist link in the description. 
as well as the links to the other videos so that you can get to them easily. Those will change later as I get more and more episodes and have too many to start linking in the, in the description. But as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!